call me an old single grandpa? That's my fault. I told her to insult you to gain your love. You thought that the best insult would be to come after the fact that me and my husband just separated. I'm so sorry. I didn't know that y'all were newly separated. Maybe if you weren't so mean, you'd still be together. Excuse me? <laughs> you might have a point though. Hold on. I'm trying to understand these rules. So like you can say that, but I can't new to the insult like you you can't come the first insult can't be like like that like you just you got to work your way into it like hey grandpa hey gray hair hey uh man who's been in the industry forever like but coming for someone's relationship right out the bat like you're a savage i am so sorry i didn't mean to insult you yes she did she meant to insult you just a little too far but she meant to insult you Okay, but I'm missing the point of why you felt the need to insult me. Well, because Bailey said that that was the way to your heart and to how to become your friend and I want to be your friend. That was, that was really, that was sweet, wasn't it? It was sweet of her. Say you love her and that she is now your friend. You can't force friendships, Bailey. That's not how this works. Can't force friendships? Yes, I can. Be her friend. Y'all are friends now. Woohoo. You were ridiculous. Anyways, why did y'all call me back here? What'd y'all need? I can't be a part of this. I'm just, I'm... Minding my business, just minding my business. I'm listening. I was wanting to bring up Tina's kid. Like it's distracting to my clients who are here to relax and she's like peeing on the floor. And I, I don't think it's very professional. What? I've thought the same thing. Like I'm really annoyed. Like I understand that she needs to take care of her kid and stuff. But like this isn't a, a daycare. This is a salon. Thank goodness. About time. Ooh, I didn't mean to say that out loud. Uh, um, so anyways, I've decided that soon I'm going to talk to the owner about it because I'm, I'm annoyed. Oh, so like you can't outright fire her. Like you have to go through the owner. You're the manager. Can't you just be like, get out. I thought you were minding your own business, Bailey. Oopsie. I can hear the damn kid screaming again. I'm going to go call him. I'm done with this.